we've come out of three years of drought now. Worst we've had in 100 years. In our local setting, climate change is, is lived, it's felt, and uh, farmers are probably the true custodians of our landscapes. They're the ones essentially at the front line of the situation. My goal or my vision is to try and inspire more, try and inspire people that have got custodianship to act. My name is Justin Gerd. I'm a co-director of Living Lands. I'm based in the, in the Bavianskloof, a small part of South Africa, where um, we're trying to, to rehabilitate landscapes. We're trying to find a local economy that give back to the ecology more than what it takes out and simultaneously allow for landowners to free up spaces of their farms that can have active restoration happen. So one of the things we're trialing in the Bavianskloof is to plant aromatic herbs and see if we can distill them to produce essential oils. That allows farmers to earn a, a better income of a smaller portion of their land, which allows us then to rehabilitate and restore the rest of their land. So by planting certain species or rehabilitating certain areas, you could potentially put carbon back into the ground and trade with it and sell it on the international carbon market. A livestock farmer would traditionally be doing one event. You have that same farmer having multiple income streams. So it's more resilient to the effects of a changing world. As soon as you start getting your hands dirty, then you start seeing what it actually takes. And uh, this is a massive challenge. It's a huge challenge, probably the, the biggest challenge the world's ever faced. We've got to be humble and start doing it. Let's just start doing whatever it is we can.